Hey there, it's Elliot. Today, we're diving into the common question. How can I remove the iPhone lock to owner message, also known as the iCloud activation lock, from my device? I bet a few of you have run into this issue on your iPhones, iPads, or Apple Watches, haven't you? Now let's address the elephant in the room. There are a ton of services, software, and methods out there claiming to do this for you, but let's be real. Some are shady, some are expensive, and some just flat out don't work. But no worries, my friends, because there's a better way, a safe way, totally legal, and best of all, free. Plus, it's quicker, and I guarantee it's going to do the job. So stick around. We'll get that lock cleared off your device in no time. This is a quick reminder, folks. We're sharing this information for folks who own their devices but need to find their login details. We're not here to help anyone do anything shady like unlock stolen stuff. That's not cool, and it's against the law. We're all about following YouTube's rules and keeping things on the up and up. Now that we've got that clear, let's get to it. When unlocking your iPhone from the locked to owner message, you've got a few trusted allies. Now, I remember when I was stuck with a locked iPhone. I tried a bunch of software, wasted loads of time, and still needed help to unlock it. Then, I stumbled upon these tools. They're super easy to use and reliable, and the best part is that they get the job done quickly. For instance, Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app is a game changer. Its AI interface guides you through the process, making it as easy as pie. Then there's Safe Unlocks, and well, the name says it all. It's safe and secure and unlocks your device just like that. Next up is Lock to Owner. I've had a few of our viewers swear by its effectiveness. And last but not least, there's the iUnlock app. This one's great for those who prefer an app-based solution. It's user-friendly and quick, saving you a lot of hassle and time. Remember, these are merely tools, and you're in control. Use them wisely. Now, hang tight, because in the next step, we will walk you through how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Get ready to be amazed. Please be aware that our Unlock services are primarily designed to operate in first world countries. If you're unable to access our Unlock services or prefer not to utilize them, don't worry. We have another exciting option available for you. Each week, we offer 250 free unlocks to our diligent viewers. Participating is simple. Here's what you need to do to be eligible. Click the like button below this tutorial video. Ensure you're subscribed to our channel. Finally, post a comment below this video mentioning your phone model, for example. Samsung S9, IMEI, and country. As soon as you complete these steps, you'll be automatically entered into our weekly draw for a free unlock service. Good luck, and we are looking forward to unlocking possibilities for you. All right, let's kick things off. Grab your phone or hop on your computer and head over to unlockhere.com. This site uses an AI assistant named Nifty to help unlock any mobile restrictions you're facing. Once there, let Nifty know you need an iCloud to unlock by clicking on Activation Lock. You'll be given an option to select your device. If you have an iPhone, go ahead and like that. But you can also choose if you have an iPad or an Apple Watch. Next, you'll need to enter your device's IMEI or serial number. What is the difference? Well, all iPhones have IMEIs. If you're unlocking an iPhone, choose IMEI. Some iPads and Apple Watches have IMEIs if they have SIM card slots or cellular capacity. If they don't, they'll have a serial number. To find this, press the sleep button on your locked device, then press it again and tap on the I on the bottom right. This will show your device info. Once you've got your device info, remember to input this in the next step. You must fill in some basic info to attach your order to your account. You must use accurate information so you can receive your order confirmation. Next, agree to the terms and confirm that you're not planning on unlocking a stolen device. Solve a quick captcha to prove you're not a robot and then hit start process. But we're not done yet. You'll get an email with your confirmation code. Sometimes it lands in your spam or junk folder, so check there too. Take this code, go back to the Unlock Here website, input the code, and confirm once more that you're not a robot. As soon as you've done that, your unlock process begins. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone locked to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it will be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again, once it's finally unlocked. So it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. 
Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now, go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap forget password or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. So that's it. Your device is now on its way to being unlocked. But stick with us. Another method is coming up for those who want a different approach. All right, guys, let's explore alternative ways to unlock iCloud activation lock. It's essential to stick to legal methods, so here are a few you can follow, ensuring you're not infringing on any laws or guidelines Apple sets. Apple support. The first method is straightforward. If you're the device's original owner, contact Apple support. They'll ask for proof of purchase documents, and once verified, they'll help you remove the lock. Removal by previous owner. If you've bought a second-hand device with the iCloud activation lock still on, you can contact the previous owner to remove the device from their iCloud account. They can do this remotely by signing into their iCloud account on a computer and removing the device from the Find My section. iCloud activation lock removal services. Various trusted services can help you remove the iCloud activation lock. Some require a fee, so research the most reputable and cost-effective option. Always remember to read reviews and be aware of the risks involved with each method. After following these methods, set up a new Apple ID and password to secure your device. Remember that while sharing this information for educational purposes, you must respect Apple's terms and conditions. That's it for today. Happy unlocking.